My Sword and Shield Expansion Pass trailer is very, very interesting. I actually watched it a whole bunch of times today, and I gotta say, I like what I see. So, I might as well cover it in a video. Pretty sure everybody else already saw it. I just love how they just started off with Galarian Slowbro. And I gotta say, my I cannot wait to actually evolve my shiny Slowpoke into like this. Even though it'll be in constant pain. Which is actually a terrible thing to say out loud. I don't know, should I cover any of the information? Because, you know, all the other PokeTubers already covered some of the information. There's some returning Pokemons, Urshifu new moves, and Dynamax Garatina. Yeah, I don't know why people keep confusing Dynamax and Gigantamax. Gigantamax is where a Pokemon changes form. Dynamaxing is when a Pokemon stays the same but just gets bigger. And then there's Eternal Max, but we're not going to get into that. To be honest, I also feel like if Game Freak had an extra like year to work on Sword and Shield, I literally mean a good extra year, some of this stuff could have been implemented into the game. Like when people say they can't add anything else, they just talking out their butts. It's clearly that they can because Sword and Shield, the base game by itself, still has a lot of room. So this is why they can add more. And since they are bringing back at least 100 Pokemons apiece, that leaves out 200 more Pokemon. So, if there's going to be another DLC, it would have been mostly called the Crown Jewel. I don't know what the other one is going to be, but it's going to most likely be mostly about Eternatus. Because usually we get like a, you know, sister game that I always explain about the third legendary. I don't know, will these games explain anything about Eternatus? Uh, hopefully they do. Also, Calyrex has a, has a tail. That that always been bothering me. I don't know why. If it, Well, more stuff about the Crown Tundra. Also, in the DLC, if you want to jack... If you want to, you know... Make a Gigantamax Pokemon. For example... If you have a Grimmsnarl on your team... You just take it to the Isle of Armor with you and you gotta find recipes to make um, Max Soup and then returning legendaries. So Max Soup, soup will help you your Pokemon gain that ability. And they also release the starters with their hidden abilities. So you know there's videos about how to get that but I'm gonna have to work on that later. I have no hotspots, so I can't really get them just yet. Now, to be honest, I am going to be working on getting some extra Urchi food, so if anyone's interested, let me know. And some more extra Pokemon, and hopefully, some of these Pokemon, like the legendaries, new ones are not shiny lot, but most likely they will be. I'm just kind of hoping that they're not. And this is also a new thing, but it's coming with a Crown Tundra. I can't remember what it was called. I think Star Galar? But it's like a tournament based thing that's dealing with um, double battles in, in the Rose Stadium. And the DLC is, will be released on basically in two weeks, June 17th. So, you know, I would actually say if you did buy the DLC, it would be best to wait till 12 o'clock in the morning to see what they release it then or wait till later on that, later on the day. But I'm probably going to stay up until 12 to see, can I get lucky? And also, I am talking to some hackers on eBay, seeing can they can change my Pokemon's abilities for me before the DLC comes out so good luck I, I really need some good luck on that and I'm doing some shiny hunting too so a lot of things are going on before the DLC drops so let me know what you guys girls thinks about this of course when I actually do play this I will be I don't know should I be skeptical about it because 
Sword and Shield DLC wasn't thought about, nor was it truly planned until after the release of Sword and Shield. So, after all that craziness, they decided to do DLC. So, I'm still just going to be skeptic. You know, just going to make sure that, you know, if the dex cut was still worth it or not to me. But that's just me, because, you know, remember... Bring back National Dex, all that good goodness. So I shall talk to y'all later. But, you know, I'll be looking at the comments, seeing whoever want to have a discussion about something. So I shall t talk to y'all later.